Hello everyone, my name is Alexander Mendes and today I'm going to show you how to launch the admin power center admin console from a Linux and Unix machine. The steps here they apply for any power center version. Okay, so the agenda for the video is first uh, normally we see uh, the power center admin console being launched from a client machine like a Windows machine or any other machine like a, a Mac so this is normally what we see in the environment but there are, there are some circumstances that might be useful for uh, launching the power center admin console uh, from the Unix box or Linux or Unix server directly from OS command line so this is how we are going to see, this is what we are going to see here. This can be done, uh, but you need to use a Excel Windows client. It's basically it's a utility for emulate graphical interface in a client machine from a Linux Unix server. In the example today here, I'm going to use mobile extern, but there is a, a bunch of other softwares available for doing that. Okay, so I'm in a client machine, a Windows client machine. I'm going to launch the the browser. This is normally how we we do. So I'm going to connect here to the to the browser. Just launch the administrator page. So it's available here. I just need to type the username and password to log in. This is normally how we see, how we use it, but now let me show you the launching the, doing the same thing, but from the uh, Linux prompts. Okay, now let me launch the application. Like I said, I'm going to use mobile extern for this testing. This is a X Windows client, so I'm going to open here my session. Type my username, password. So that's it. I'm logged. As you can see, this is a Linux box. Let me show you here. It's a head head machine. Okay. So now what I need to do is that I need to first thing is set the environment variable display to the IP address of my client machine. In my case, my Windows client machine IP is this one here. I just set it. I'm going to validate. Oh, it's it has been set. Second, first I need to make sure that this <coughs> uh, Linux machine it has a browser. In this case, I'm going to use Firefox for this testing. So which Firefox? It shows me that I have Firefox installed under USR Bing directory. So now I'm going to launch Firefox. Oh, before I, I launch it, I need to validate that this X Windows is working as expected. So I just type this command line, X clock, and I, I'll wait for a minute. I can see this is just a warning message, but the most important figure is here at the bottom. We see now a clock. Uh, it shows me that the 
X Windows configuration is working fine. So now I'm, I'm able to launch the Firefox. Just close it. Let me run the command line. Firefox. Okay, just type it Firefox. Now it, as we can see, just launched the, the browser. So this browser is running here from the Linux OS prompt, but it's emulating in my client machine. This can be done through this setting here, the display setting. So I'm going to launch the same browser, the same URL. Okay, so as you could see here, now we have the Firefox browser running from Linux OS prompt, emulating it in a client in a Windows client machine through the X Windows client that I'm using and the display setting. So in summary, today you have learned how to launch the Power Center admin console from a Linux and Unix OS prompt. The steps here they are very useful for, for troubleshooting issues where Power Center admin console does not, not launch in a client machine for some reason, but everything seems to be working fine in the server. So doing these steps here, you see that everything is working fine in the power center side most likely there is something in between the client machine and the power center server machine that is blocking the admin console to launch as, as expected something like a, a firewall blocking a port or something else please get in touch by uh, support videos at informatica.com or by infosport We'd love to hear from you. Thank you.